Hey YouTube, what's going on? This is Cheeseboy628 here today giving you a doubles Pokemon Showdown battle. And there are a ton of things I want to address in this video. First off being I added music to the battle preview here just because I just looked at one of my battle previews on a different video and I thought it was boring so I thought this may spice it up a bit. And then also, since there's a new channel layout going on, I need a cover photo. So it'd be cool if you guys were interested in making one for me. I'll talk more about that after the battle. But anyway, as you can see on the right side there, that is Jiggle Physics' account. And basically, we just made another team together. I picked the three pokes on the left, and he did the three on the right. And they're all pretty standard. Only thing is, I have a sub SD Ferrothorn. I thought of all times that I'm going to try, you know what? I might as well try it in a doubles match. Yeah, so looking at my opponent's team here, he has a bunch of threats. This match is really just going to be hyper offense. It's just let's see who can take something of the opponent's first. So, yeah, let's see how this battle goes. So, he starts out with his Caesar and Alakazam, and I start out with my Ferrothorn and Scrafty. And well, right off the bat, Alakazam has friggin' HP fire, so that's kind of unfortunate for me. My goal was to take out this Alakazam thinking that it had Sash, though. That's why I attacked it with both my Ferrothorn and my Scrafty here. And so, I'm surprised that my Ferrothorn even took that, seeing as it doesn't exactly have a lot of defense investment, it's just max HP and then admin max attack. So, unfortunately they don't really get to do too much, the priority kills off here. And so I just bring in Cress and Thunder's T. They're basically a good pair to come in here as I can go for the discharge, do a nice chunk to everything. Unfortunately, the Caesar is able to take out that Cresselia with the bug bite. Ah, oh, it's too powerful. Technician and all that. Stab, super effective, bam. But yeah, I was able to live one more for life, one more life orb hit and that's it for that, but also Conkeldur goes down here. He didn't go for the mock punch this time. I was surprised, but it's all right. I'm glad that happened. <laughs> It'll just make this match a lot closer. It's just my uh, Gastrodon and Rotom Wash here, and so I'm going to go for the discharge, take the closer down to his focus sash, and basically the cloister is now dead, thankfully. So it's going to be Rotom Wash and the Jolteon versus my two. Unfortunately, Rotom Wash is at a very low amount of HP, and Gastro is just going to go for the Earth Power after I get Will O Wisp by the Rotom Wash. And you'll see why he goes for the Will O Wisp. So basically, my goal here, I'm just going to go for the Surf so I can hit both things since I know Jolteon will die of anything now. He goes for the Hidden Power, whatever it is, I take it very easily. Unfortunately, I get a crit, and so I think this will just be a stall where all I have to do is recover off here, but no! He hits me with the hidden power, and he gets another crit, ends it early. It did matter a little bit, and uh, either way, it was a really close match. Very enjoyable. So that was definitely an awesome battle flask. Yeah, I th according to the sets, I think I have max special attack modest, and he. I'm guessing he had max HP, and like we had the same sets regarding HP and special attack I'm guessing but basically I would have done about 20% with every surf so after I just get recovers I think I would have won the stall war either way it probably wouldn't have been that enjoyable to watch so cutting it off early may have been nice so yeah hopefully you guys enjoyed anyway regarding the announcement about the new layout not really sure I feel about the new layout but I do need to make an intro now for new people checking out the channel and then I also need a cover photo and that's what I'm asking you guys to do here if anyone's willing to do some cover art if you're any good with that I'm willing to take anything as long as it's appropriate of course and if you're looking for any specific Pokemon that you want to put on the cover photo Lapras is definitely my thing my favorite Pokemon ever and yeah that's really all the guidelines I have for you have any more questions feel free to inbox me and yeah, I would definitely appreciate it. So yeah, guys, thank you for watching. Like, comment, sub, and until later, peace.